On Wednesday, I got approved to become a McDonald's owner operator. This journey began whenever I started at McDonald's at the age of 10 years old. But for the sake of time, we'll start the story back in 2015. I had just graduated high school and I was moving to Waynesburg, Pennsylvania to go to college. I stayed for about two semesters, but I was really missing home, so I moved back to Kentucky. May of 2016. So when I moved back home, I started working for my family's restaurants again, and that reignited the love that I had for McDonald's. And I decided to go back to school for business so I can really understand how business actually works. And in 2018, I finally got promoted to a salary position. I worked 50 to 60 hours a week, all night shifts. So I would go in at two and leave at about two in the morning. And it pretty much stayed like that until July of 2020, whenever a general manager position opened up at another store. So as a general manager, I had a lot of freedom to kind of push new ideas. My store helped plan and execute the drive-through velocity plan. And also I was sending monthly updates for the awesome things that the restaurant was doing and texting as many corporate people as I could just to put my name on the radar. And in April of 2021, I finally got an interview for the Next Gen program. Luckily, the interview went well and Morgan Book even made me a cake to wish me good luck. I got accepted. So the next gen process is a 12 to 18 month training program that corporate uses as an assessment to make sure that you're equipped to be an owner operator. And after I was accepted, my whole life changed. I couldn't do next gen over the Kentucky stores because my brother had already done that. So we found two stores in Ohio and that's when I moved my wife and my daughter four hours away to start the program. And I'm gonna be honest with you, at the beginning, we had no idea what we were doing or what we had gotten ourselves into. But luckily, we were put in an awesome position with crew and managers that were so supportive of us. But don't get it twisted. There has been a lot of late nights, blood, sweat, and tears that have went into this. And 11 months later, I'm done with the program. But I'm not treating this as the end. I'm looking at this as a new beginning for my McDonald's journey. And I'm excited to see where it keeps taking us. If you guys enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a like. And if you're interested to hear more about my McDonald's journey, please just drop a comment below. Subscribe to follow along for whenever I buy my first McDonald's. If you guys made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. It's your support that helps me keep going each and every day.